The world is not the same. Old ways have changed. It's not easy. The world is suffering. The question is, can we fix it? Who can save this troubled world and making it a better place? Someone who has better senses. Someone who is stronger. Someone who is faster. Someone who has superhuman power. Someone who has a colorful king. Hmm. I think I know what you are thinking. Are you referring to a superhero? Yes, we need a superhero. Have you ever wondered that that someone could be you? Oh yes, it can be you. Or you, or you. A hero can be anyone. You may not be able to fly, grow boss, or regenerate your limbs. As long as you can make a difference to someone's life, then you are a superhero. Just like the main character of our today's book recommendation entitled Alias Mission Saving the Food of Iraq. This book tells you a different kind of superhero. It is based on true events in the life of a real person who shows us it's not necessary to see through walls or fly or have any superpowers at all to be a real life superhero. Her name's Aliyah. Alia Muhammad Baker. She was the chief librarian of the Central Library in Basra, Iraq. This 2003, as the war in Iraq draws closer and closer to Basra, Alia grows increasingly fearful that the irreplaceable pressures of her library are in grave danger. Her pleas to government officials go ignored, so Alia comes up with a plan of her own. Determined to preserve the history and culture of her people, Alia undertakes a courage and extremely dangerous task of smuggling over 30,000 books from the library to a safe place. Did you see how one person like Alia can make a difference? I really appreciate the enormous dedication and courage of Mrs. Baker that consider keeping the books safe as just doing her job as a librarian. In order for you to know how Mrs. Aliyah Muhammad Baker did the heroic act, please include this book in your summer reading list, Aliyah's Mission, Saving the Book of Iraq. This was told in a dramatic graphic novel by the renowned cartoonist Mark Alan Istamati. So, have you ever wondered if you had what it takes to save the world? Well, I am. And I already found out my super power. Guess what? I am a librarian. A super librarian. What's yours?